Hey guys, I know a lot of people have been requesting this and maybe this is for newer players on PES 2020, especially the ones who have come from FIFA. The menus in PES aren't the friendliest of menus. Not exactly sure what they were thinking when they designed this for the online modes, but today I want to show you all the available options for online play with your friends from co-op versus my club in the simplest way possible. In the description below, you'll see the timestamps of each mode so you can skip easily to the one you want. If this has helped you out, please hit the like button and share it with anyone that might find it useful. I will be doing this on Xbox, but I assume that it applies for PlayStation 2. Let's start with Standard versus Play, or Pez calls it Player Match Lobby. You can find this in Kickoff. These are default teams, Manchester United, Arsenal, Barcelona, etc. First, you have to log into the Pez servers. Pick any that are not full, of course. The closest to your country, the better the connection. Then just click any lobby that isn't full in that server. You'll have to jump through these hoops for all standard online modes. Next, you can call your server room name whatever you want. I just left mine as my gamer tag, and then you just need to choose your room security. You have three options, and the first option is no security. This means anyone can jump in, even those that are not on your friends list. You can set a password, but make sure whoever you're inviting knows the password. And the easiest option is if you're inviting just your party and that is entrance limitations. This only allows anyone you invite. After you decide on your security for the game, select next. Here you can change the game settings, the ball, duration of the match, extra time, etc. Then select next. You can also change this in the game room menu later. It helps to change the general game settings later as you can start inviting players and while you're waiting, you can change the game settings. Okay, so from here, invite your friends from your friends list or invite them from your party. Wait for your friend to get into your room and select start match. Everyone has to select start to get to the next screen where you choose your teams. Choose the teams in the next menu, change your weather, stadium or your game plan and select start match and that's it. Whoever's hosting can change the weather and stadium. So next guys is a team play lobby. Same again like player match lobby, you will find the team play lobby in kickoff. The same options apply, select the server, select the lobby and then select next. The game options are slightly different here. You can select 11 versus 11 or 11 versus the CPU or COM. You can choose the other options like the capacity of the friends, what means how many people you want in your room, how many players it will take to auto start the game, if you want your legend player included from be a legend mode, if you want people to have a choice of any player to select or a single player. I'll explain that in a second. And if you want to be able to select the goalkeeper. And lastly, select the different security options that are stated in the player match lobby. Select next and change any general settings you would like to change. Hit next again and you will have the option to choose a legend player or existing player. I have no legend player so I selected the existing player. As before, invite your friends or party and select start match. The next screen is where you have to pick if you're playing home or away. Remember, if you're playing home, you have the ability to change the weather and the stadium. On the next screen is where you pick your teams. When you're ready to select kickoff, you can see any player highlighted. Just select that to be any player on the pitch, but to pick a specific player, just go to that player and select him. This is normally useful if you have a new player to PES and it allows them to concentrate on one player. Or maybe you have 22 players and all of you want to pick a player each. The game will start after the counter has gone down to zero. As you can see, there's a cancel button, but it doesn't always work. So if you select the wrong player or you wanted to select any player, you may be stuck and you may have to start the whole process again. Okay, onto my club versus and co-op modes. Remember, you can check the timestamp in the description below to help you go to the specific section. Also guys, remember to hit that like button if this is helping you out. Let's start with the simple versus mode in my club. Start by going to the match heading at the top, then go to my club player match lobby. As before, select the server, select the lobby and create your room with security options and head over to the general match settings to change your game options. After you select next, select invite and invite your party or your friend and start the match. Nice and simple. Now comes the more difficult section. This is the co-op game type in my club. Go back to the match heading and head over to my club co-op. In order to invite players to play co-op, you have to create a clan. That's fairly simple. Just select the name you want to use and start searching for your friends to invite. Go to the friends list Find the friend you want to add, select invite and wait for the friend to accept the invite in their request receive page. Once they accept your clan invitation, go to the clan match option and there you can create the room and then select some slightly different options. 
You can choose if you want to play the computer or actual people. But if the person you're playing against are on their own, then two computer players will play alongside them, making it three versus three. You have other options you can change, like difficulty of other team strength, their co-op level, courtesy level, and of course, the room security options like the previous modes. After you've selected next, here you can select match room menu. It's X on the Xbox, and then head to invite and select the friends or party that you want to play alongside you. And there you have it, select start match, and you're ready to play with your friends in co-op match. Thanks for watching guys, appreciate any feedback and comments. Please hit that like button if it's helped you and subscribe for more PEZ content.